morning class. Welcome to our online class. I am super excited to have you here. Excited about all the amazing discussion we have today. This week, I'll be sharing the significant topic in just making mind. Let us start a day with an opening prayer. Bernadette, can you please lead the prayer? And even the Father of the Son of the Holy Spirit. Amen. How's your day, class? That is great. Before settling down, may I remind all of you to please observe health protocols at all times. Thank you. Anna, I'd like to know how many absentees we have today. No one is absent? That is good to know. Keep it up. Before we begin, kindly submit your assignment through our blogging cluster. Thank you. Before we proceed with our discussion, kindly refresh our mind regarding on our previous lesson. Chris. Very good. Garment packing materials are durable in nature and find uses, usage in packaging garments in a well-maintained and proper manner. What are the examples of packing materials, Anna? Very well said. They are packing card card, plastic clip, foam sheet, and steel head pins. It seems everyone is ready for today's lesson. You have learned enough for our previous lesson. Before we proceed with our discussion, we will have this activity entitled Photo Exhibit. What can you say about these pictures, Carlos? That is right. There are some boxes, paper bags in a department store with clothing or apparel. Based from the picture you have guessed, what do you think our topic today? Carla. Yes, you got it. From packing materials, today, we'll discuss about packaging. Our topic for today's lesson is all about packaging finished garments. We will be guided by the following objectives. Learning objective number four, apply finishing touches on children's wear. We have the general objective 4.4 pack finish garment and our specific objectives are the following number one explain the functions of packaging number two distinguish the different various material used for packaging of clothing and apparel number three make a sample of packaging materials To further understand our lesson, Jane, define what is packaging. Brilliant answer! Packaging may be defined as the activities of designing and producing the container or the wrapper for the product. Generally, the packaging could be considered as the silent salesman of the product. Ivana what are the functions of packaging? You are correct. We have product identification, product protection, facilitating the use of product, and product promotion. Now, in product identification, packaging greatly helps in identification of products. So, what is product will be found inside of the package. In product protection, packaging protects the content of a product from spoilage, breakage, leakage, etc. Facilitating the use of product, packaging should be convenient to open, handle, and use for the consumers. While the product promotion, packaging is also used for promotional and attracting the attention of the people while purchasing. Basically, the clothing manufacturer is using three kinds of packaging. 
What are the three kinds of packaging? Identify these three pictures. Yes, Patricia. Good thinking. We have primary, secondary, and shipping or tertiary package. Primary package. Insertion of garment into a pulley bag is considered as the primary package of garment. Secondary package. A garment could be another pulley bag or inner carton. While the shipping or tertiary package. This refers to a packaging for necessary for storage, identification, or transportation of the products. In secondary packaging or secondary package, there are four packing strategies. What are the four packing strategies? So, we have solid color, solid size. All garments are of same size and color. So here is the example. Number two, solid color assorted size. Color of all pieces is same, while there is variation in size. Next, we have assorted color solid size. Color of garment is different, while size is same. And the last one, we have assorted color, assorted size. Garments are of different color and sizes. Now you can see the example. Okay, now you can see now the example of four packing strategies in secondary package. Now what can you say? Do you have any questions? Clarifications? Okay. Basically, cartons are used as shipping package. You will see the side of cartons, the carton number, carton measurement, quantity in pieces, net weight, in single product, net weight, in six pieces product, gross weight, that is the full cartoon, and we have the main mark, the buyer name, the consignee's address, order number, the style number, color, size, breakdown, destination, etc. And the cartoon measurement, we have the 3-ply inner, 5-ply, and the 7-ply. We have to ensure the quality. Quality is the most important factor in textile sector. Buyer always emphasis on quality. So it is needed to care always on quality. A quality product always turns more buyer. So you have to remember. Basically, cartons are used as shipping package. What can you see outside the carton? Jason? Yes, you are right. So, in the side of the carton, you can see the console number, the item number, quantity, net weight, gross weight, and also the measurement of the carton. Next, we have also the sticker attached on the carton. You can see the logo, to on which you are going to ship the product, from, from what company. We have the lot number. The reference number, ship date, weight, the handle with care to secure the safety of the product, delivery instructions, and we have the item number, stitching of clothing and apparel. Now, what do you think are the various materials are used for clothing and apparel? What are the available materials that you can find in your locality? Yes, Joy? Perfect answer. So, we have the paper and cardboard. They are very popular packaging material. So, here is the example. Next, we have the plastic material. It has revolutionized the packaging, packaging industry. So, here is also the example. 
But we have to beware of using so much plastic material because if we will not know how to throw it in the right trash can or recycle this material, it can destroy our environment. Okay, next we have the glass material. Glass packaging does not just protect, it actually adds value to its contents. Because you can see on the spot the quality or the appearance of the product when you're using the glass material. Next, we have the non-woven fabric material. The non-woven fabrics are dynamic, value-added alternative to more traditional materials. So this kind of material, we can see that they are using in department store. Next, we have the tin and steel can. It is 100 recyclable without loss in quality. Now you can see all the example of the various material used for packaging of clothing and apparel. Now, what do you think is the most or best material that you can use in your place? Okay, so all of them can be used for packaging a floating in a pile as long as you know how to make and as long as you know how to dispose them properly after using all of these materials. Now, here are the sample of secondary packaging design for children's work. Can you see about the sample, Anna? Very good. It is beautiful. We will need to follow the lines to make the beautiful bags and boxes. The box. We will need first to make a pattern because those lines will be our guide on how to fold the sample packaging. On the left side of this screen, we will have a bag color pink it is suited to our little girl because it has flower and butterfly next we have the bag the color is blue good for the boy and it has a very simple design you can also put a black color heart or a circle on the at the center of the bag while the next design we have a box you can put on the top of the box like butterfly, heart, or flowers, or any kinds of design that is also suited to, you, to our or to your design. Okay, so those are the examples. Now, what do you think are the qualities that you are going to de develop when you are going to make this packaging design? Yes, Carol. Very good. You will develop your skill on how to make packaging design. You will become creative and you will become resourceful. Okay, any clarification or questions about this sample secondary packaging designs? Very good. You can also sell this boxes or design to your neighborhood if you will make it beautiful and presentable to your customer. It is your additional impact. Good thinking, Maria. So here are another example of the primary packaging map for you to understand. So you will need the following materials like Hard and soft cartoon, paper, additional accessories like tie, and don't forget to make your logo for your product. Now, what can you see about this design? Layer. Very good. It is simple. Now, do you want to add some more in additional information? Questions? None? Okay, so we will be giving an assess assessment if you learn something for today's lesson.
please be ready. We will summarize our topic. Here are the things that you should remember. Packaging. Packaging may be defined as the activities of designing and producing the container or the wrapper for the product. We have the functions of the packaging product identification, product protection, facilitating the use of product, and product promotion. We have three types of packaging, primary, secondary, shipping or tertiary package. In secondary package, we have four packing techniques. Solid color, solid size. Next, we have solid color, assorted size. Next, assorted color, solid size. And the last one, assorted color, assorted size. We use the carton, are used as shaping package. Now, you will see what are the things you, you have found in the cartons. Next, we have the various materials that are used for packaging. We have the paper and cardboard, plastic material, glass materials, non-woven fabric material, tin and steel can. And then, we discussed already the additional designs. We have the secondary and primary designs that I was given you already, I hope. You understand our lesson today. Now, please be ready for our assessment. Now, that you know about packaging, let us have a short quiz. Choose the correct word to complete the sentence. Basically, I will read the question and I have chosen already your name to answer that particular question. It will be selected randomly. If you will answer it correctly, then you will get a point. If the given answer will wrong, I will choose name again until the correct answer is given. So are you ready? Let us start with the first question. Ruby, what is your answer? People. Let us see if your answer is correct. It is correct, so you get point. Next question. Packaging should be convenient to open, handle, and blank for the consumers. Mary, what is your answer? Use. Let us see if your answer is correct. Good job. You will receive point. Now, in question number three, insertion of garment into a poly bag is considered as the blank package of garments. Yes, Gloria, what is your answer? Primary, let us check your answer. Okay, very good. Primary is the correct answer. You will receive point. Next question, Carlo. Cartons are used as blank package. What is your answer? Shipping. Did I see if your answer is correct? Very good. You will receive point. Last number and last question. Yes, June. Paper and cardboard, they are very blank packaging material. What is your answer? Popular. Let, let us check your answer. Very good. Popular is the correct answer. Good job, chat. Guys, I know that you have learned from our topic today. Thank you for your cooperation. Now for your assignment, make one sample of packaging design from primary to shipping design based from the various materials used for packaging of clothing and apparel in other sample design. You can make use of recycled material such as fabric, plastic, cardboard, etc. You can ask help from your parent, guardian, about your hardship.
Deadline of submission of your video or output will be on Monday, May 16, 2021 at 6 p.m. Your output will be guided through this scoring rubrics. So we have the tools and materials, workmanship, economy, safety work habits, and time management. So the highest score that you will get is 5 and the lower score is 1. Please be guided. Thank you class for your cooperation. Have a great day. See you again next time. Any questions or clarification? You can find me at lorileabad at gmail.com or lorileabad in my Facebook account. Thanks. My credits and appreciation to the following.